after studying all the previous properties now we come to another properties that electric field lines never cross each other if there is a positive charge here and a negative charge here then this line goes like this and this line goes like this this cannot happen even if these are not there there is one electric field line at this space and there is another electric field lines in this space which are crossing each other these are not possible and that means it is not permissible why because at the point of intersection if we take this line as field line then tangent on this shows that force will experience in this direction f is equal to q e so force will be in this direction if we consider this line this one then we say force is acting in this direction so if i place a charge here this line in form force is acting in this direction this line in form force is acting in this direction but in physics we know at any one point on one particle the force will act only in one direction so these two directions are not possible so why these two directions are showing because we have made the diagram wrong there is nothing wrong with the principle that there will be at one point one direction of force that means we have made our diagram wrong and this making a diagram where the lines are crossing each other is erroneous that is wrong and we should not make it so we make a principle that two lines will never cross each other and this is a very important principle that why two lines cannot cross each other and i will write the explanation for this so two lines do not cross each other because if they do then at the point of cross section there should be two directions of force along the tangent which is not possible therefore intersection of two lines is not possible therefore intersection of two lines is not possible so this is the reason for that and uh, it's a very peculiar situation mostly it is asked in the examination now next uh, we will study that when line start from the charge particle there is a particular rule about it then in which direction it can start in which direction it cannot start that we'll do in the next lecture